here's a nice little tip that'll uh, help you with a lot of different uh, capabilities. It has to do with contour cuts. Let's let's draw just a simple uh, star here, and we'll paint that a nice magenta color. A lot of folks have trouble because um, when you actually add a contour cut, you know, you go to the events or effects menu and you do contour cut, and it's actually going to assign this color right here called contour cut, right? It's like a gray color. And uh, if you want to do a perf cut, it's like the same color, right? Perf cut is like just a different shade of gray. Well, I don't know if you know this or not, but you can actually make a contour cut any color you want. Once you have the contour cut menu uh, activated, just go and choose a different color. So let's do lime green for that contour cut. And then let's go back up to our effects. And we're going to do a, another contour cut that's going to be our perf cut. And maybe we need to, you know, add some kind of different color for that. As long as it says contour right here, you can assign any color you want. So let's assign a blue to that one. Okay. So now I have a green contour cut. I've got a blue uh, perf cut. And when you go over to send this to your uh, wide format printer, right, just click on the wide format printer there. So once we get into this menu, when you click on that last tab right here, you can see I've got lime green for the kiss cut. I've got blue. Makes it easy to distinguish which one is your perf cut and which one is your contour cut. That's the tip of the day for uh, for June. Uh, I'll do some more. And uh, be sure and visit our great help site, uh, addendo.com. If you need help and training in your office, online, or just some other e-courses, check it out. I think you'll love it.